Ready? Cool. All right, here we go. <coughs> Three, two, one. It is Frankie and Gina. We got Crystal Harris in Woo! studio. Thanks for coming in. You're, you're, it's a busy week this week. You're getting married on Saturday. So busy. And you look good. You know, normally people get married, they're all nervous and stressed. Uh -huh. And you're just rolling in here looking wonderful. Oh, I have so much help. Um, expert. <laughs> <laughs> I have an expert wedding planner, Kelly Liskey, who's <laughs> also a Playboy publicist. She she wears many hats, and she's been helping with everything. It's amazing. What have you done to prepare for your wedding, like physically? Have you got a tan? Have you been working out? Um, I've been working out. Um, I mean, just just everything. Just trying to stay in shape so nice. I fit in my dress. Is there anything mentally that you need to prepare before you? It's a huge day. Um. I, I don't think so. I mean, I think we're pretty set, and Hef and I, we just want everything to kind of stay the same and just stay happy, and so as long as things don't change, I think we're good. Can I ask you a quick question? Of all the traits a guy has, what's the one trait that Hugh Hefner has that made you want to get married to him? Um, Hef is the nicest person I've ever met, and he's humble, and he's just so helpful with everything, and he genuinely really loves and cares about me, and I love and care about him too, and I really appreciate everything that he's done for me. And how big is the wedding? How many people were invited? <laughs> um, 300 people are coming. Wow. And um, it's going to be in the backyard of the mansion. Um, there's like a waterfall, waterfall in the koi pond, so we're going to get married over by there. And then the reception with all the guests. Are you going to sing at your own wedding? Because you have a song that's out. Yeah, I have a song out, but I'm not going to sing at the wedding. Um, <laughs> I don't want to have the stress. Um, we were actually just in London, and I opened the... Playboy Club over there, so you, you performed. Fun. I Club performed Queen? the song. Yeah, Club was, Queen is out on iTunes. It actually, came out on Tuesday. We're gonna play yes. it for you in a little bit. But ex so explain, like, describe the sound of the song. It's really cool. It's like a um, dance pop kind of song, and I love it so much. And we've been having so much fun with it. So I'm excited. Is an album gonna come soon? Yeah, the album's gonna come after. And is the cover of the album going to be the same cover of Playboy? Because apparently you're the cover of Playboy as well. I know, I'm so excited. The covers are different. Um, the cover of Playboy uh, hits stands on Friday, and um, it, it's really cool. I borrowed Hef's robe and mm -hmm. his, his pipe and his captain's hat uh -huh. for the cover. Um, the pictorial's really nice. Uh, the article's really nice that they wrote up, and it says... Miss Crystal Hefner on the cover. So. I only see wow. Playboy because of the uh, articles. Yeah. So the article. <laughs> Everyone gets it for the articles, right? Yes. <laughs> so you are taking his last name then? Yeah, definitely. Is it going to be Crystal Harris Hefner or just Crystal Hefner? Uh, probably just Crystal Hefner and my, my initials stay the same, so that's good. And you're from San Diego originally? I'm from San Diego, so it feels really good to be home right now. What part of San Diego? Um, I grew up in La Jolla. I went to La Jolla High School. Then I went to San Diego State. And um, before I moved to LA, I lived in downtown, so Ooh, all over. What was your favorite place to party in San Diego when you were here? Oh, I love the gas lamp. Mm -hmm. um, the clubs in LA are just not the same. Yeah. Uh, I love it down here. Um, I love Stingery and uh, Ivy's. Are they? I don't know if they're all still here. They are. Those Ivy. two are. Uh -huh. um, right before I moved, they were opening like Double Deuce. It was like the Cowboys. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> It's All that there. stuff is so fun. I love it. We're excited for, for your success with Hugh Hefner in marriage, and I'm excited for the uh, to, to check out the Playboy Oh my gosh, gonna she's, a mar she's gonna be a married woman. Okay? For the Leave article, let me finish the conversation. <laughs> Real quick though, uh, tell us about the Funny or Die video you did. Oh my gosh, so um, I made a Funny or Die video, and it kind of makes fun of the age gap between Hef and I, mm -hmm. because the age gap is 60 years. Wow. So, it's, it's just really fun, and it's just making fun of, you know, just making fun of it, and making light of this, light of everything, and I think the age doesn't matter, as long as you're having fun, so mm -hmm. it counts. Seems so. like you guys do. Are all the rest of, That's not fun. the rest of the girls next door, but the old girls next door, are they going to be at the wedding? Uh, well, they're all invited, so we'll, we'll see who shows up. <laughs> <laughs> and for all the fellas out there... Um, half an hour is how old now? 80? He's just turned 85, and I just turned 25, so... 16. And he's still able to get it done. He's, he's <laughs> awesome. He's right. amazing. I mean, you know, <laughs> most, of it, <laughs> I mean, most, <laughs> most of our nights are spent, like, watching movies or on Twitter, so he, he's really big on Twitter, so we're both on there. Uh, you cool. know what, I actually wondered that, because he, I do follow him on Twitter, I do see him tweet, and I was wondering if you tweet for him or he actually does it himself. 
Well, I used sometimes to... it seems like it's coming from you, like a girl. I can tell. <laughs> well, he used to write them out and like count out the characters, and I'd do it for him on the computer. Uh -huh. But then the iPad came out, so I bought that for him, showed him how to use it, and so now it's him and his iPad. He loves that. Awesome. iPad. <laughs> well, awesome. Crystal Harris, well, thank you so much for taking the time. I know you're busy. Yeah, thank, thank you so much for having me. Congratulations <laughs> on everything going on. It's like a girl's dream come true this week for you. It is. I feel like a princess. <laughs> yeah, and make sure you guys pick up her single club queen on iTunes. We're going to play it next, actually, yes, for right you. Yes, right here on Channel 933. Best wishes on the winning, and thank you so much again. Thank you.